Ma'am. Nineteen point two. That's good. That's fantastic. Um, now, is the three milligrams causing nausea? Uh, a little bit, but it's causing a little more. Uh, it has started causing constipation. Oh. Not, yes. <laughs> Yep, it's causing the constipation. The constipation ain't too long, just started. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, are you drinking a lot of water? Uh, yes. Okay. Um, and you're still minimizing starch portions? Uh, yes, I've minimized it uh, a lot more. Okay. And then um, you're still using the app that keeps count cal mm -hmm. with calories? Yes, and um, I keep up my weight on that too. Okay. Now, um, um, how's exercise going? It's going much better. I'm okay. doing more. Mm -hmm. I'm almost down to my goal. Okay. And how is the stress? Is is the it's, move? It's, it's, it's a little bit better because okay. uh, I found me an apartment and everything. Okay. Yes, I just got to get used to an apartment instead of a house. So have you already moved in? Uh, no, ma'am. Okay. They they still working on the apartment. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. She said. If it don't be the, the close to the end of this month, it'll be beginning of next month. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So, um, any missed doses of the Trulicity? Uh, no. I never missed a dose. Okay. I gotta get some more. I gotta get some more Alley. Okay. And um, is that something you want me to send to the pharmacy or is that something uh, you get over the counter? I can get it uh, off my get on the health care card. Okay, so I'll send a refill for that. Let me do that before I forget. And that's... Oh, uh, you don't have to uh, send a prescription the, uh, for the alley. Oh, I don't? Uh -uh. Oh, okay. Um, and then, um, usually that helps with constipation, but I guess the Trulicity is kind of working, working more. Uh huh, cause it was doing just fine until I started taking this, but I guess, I guess that's one of the side effects. It'll, I guess it'll pass. Yeah, because. well, there's a couple things that, well, there's, um, there's a couple different things that are working. Um, because you are eating less, mm -hmm. you're not going to be having as many bowel movements or not having as, as, uh, either frequent bowel movements or as much in the bowel movements because yeah. you're eating less. Yeah. But also, Trulicity can sometimes decrease thirst. Mm -hmm. um, and the number one reason for constipation is dehydration, even yeah. mild dehydration, because in order to move things along, the colon has to suck in moisture to ease the passage. Yeah. If we're dehydrated, it can't get that moisture or fluid from the surrounding tissues, so it gets stuck. Okay. So the number one rule with constipation is drink lots of fluid, lots of water. Okay. Um, if that doesn't quite work, then you can do like over the counter Miralax. Mm -hmm. um, well, I got some uh, fiber pills and stuff. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Also eating um, things that have lots of natural fiber, mm -hmm. broccoli, cabbage. Cabbage does it for me every time. <laughs> um, Everyone sometimes has that trigger food. Some people it's okra, some people it's spinach. Must be of uh, fruits. Okay, yeah. And um, so water, fiber, and possibly Miralax if necessary. Okay. Um, uh, and your blood pressure's good. All right, so... Um, And so when we started, your weight was 175.6, and now you're down in the 150s. Wow. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, so let's do a quick finger check. Okay. And... Is your apartment in a nice neighborhood? Uh, yes, it's close to uh, downtown. Okay. 
is where a lot of older people stay at. Yeah, and nothing wrong with that. Nope. <laughs> Not too much traffic. Because I don't care for too much noise. Sleep through anything, and now it's like, nope. <laughs> so, yeah, traffic on the street is not my favorite. Mm -mm. All right, you keep the pressure on that. Thank you. 117, great sugar. So, um, I guess the next question is, um, do we want to have you back in three weeks or four weeks or, um, we can do, uh, we can do another three weeks. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday? Uh, it don't make a difference. Okay. Let's see. June 22nd, which is a Wednesday, June 23rd, which is a Thursday, or June 24th, which is a Friday? I'll take the 24th. Okay. Uh, do you want 8 o'clock? Yes, ma'am. June 24th. Okay. And so are we looking... Hey, guys. I'm finally back at home. Uh, let me show you what I, I'm wearing today. I got on my cute little earrings. I forget where I got those at. And I got on... My little initial necklace that I got from, I think, the beauty supply store. And I got my BB watch on. And I'm finally wearing the bracelets that go with with the watch. And the dress that I got on is my Kevin Klein little dress with uh, some splits in it. And... Uh, the Calvin Klein sandals that go with it. I got this at Burlington, and I got the <clears throat> and I got the sandals at Burlington. And you no know, to her, I did to her. So I am so happy today, you guys. I am on top of this world. The Lord just been blessing me and blessing me and blessing me, and I just can't do nothing but say. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're supposed to thank the Lord every time you wake up in the morning anyway. For waking you up, you're supposed to thank him for that. And I got good news. I'm happy. Oh, I just got to get rid of all this acne and stuff. This, I believe it's the medicine that I'm taking that's making me break out more too. But I ain't worried about that right now. I'm just too on top of this world. And... Oh, my doctor, she's so happy for me. I'm almost at my goal. I say by August, I should be hitting that goal by my birthday. I should be hitting that goal, you guys. Yeah, I'm thankful for, for y'all to have faith in me. I'm glad y'all follow me on my journey. I'm just blessed. And then, you know when I had told you about my case specialist at Section 8 has sent me a letter saying that my rent had changed and everything. And I told you guys that the rent, my rent folks owed me back pay for April and May because I paid too much rent on both months. So 
I showed them the letter. I emailed it back to them and stuff. I know they got it, but I still emailed them. They want to see mine and stuff, too. So, I took a screenshot of it, of the letter, and I emailed it back to them. And this month, <laughs> I don't owe no rent, baby. I don't owe no rent. I called and made sure. I looked at my porter on my phone because I was going to pay the rent this morning. I looked at my porter. I was like, uh-uh. I ain't going to believe it until I heard it out of their mouth. And they said, Miss Simmons, you don't have no rent this month. I said, are you sure? Because I don't want no, I don't want to hear nobody's mouth saying I owe for rent. Because I always pay my rent on the first. And she said, no, Miss Simmons, you don't owe no rent this month. I said, I don't owe the house insurance either. She said, nope, that's paid for two. I said, oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm just waiting on my apartment to be ready and everything. So I can go see that. And I'm just, because the Lord, he's blessing me. I, uh, I know I've been stressed and everything, but everything is coming together. And and what I don't, what I'm not taking to my apartment, I'm putting in storage for my son. So when he getting, because he, him and his wife looking for a house. And I told them to go in the storage and take all that, that I left in there for him. My refrigerator, my lawnmower, I'm giving him my wash and dryer, everything. Because it's going to be a wash and dryer already over there in the apartment. Everything is coming into the apartment and everything, all the plants and stuff. So I don't have to, I don't need mines. So I'm giving it all to my son. So he don't have, him and his wife don't have to worry about it. Nothing. They don't have to worry about no lawnmower. They don't have to worry about none of that stuff. But I told them, I'm sorry. Can't have my patio set. I gave them one of my wine carts. I gave them a wine cart. I gave them wine glasses and everything. I'm giving half my stuff that I don't need. I'm giving it to them. And most of half my Christmas decorations that I'm not going to need over there at that apartment. I'm giving it to them and stuff. And everything. So... My blessings are going to them and stuff. I'm blessing them for their house and everything. So, I'm happy about my weight. I done lost 19 point something in all. I think I forgot what she said. It's in my purse and everything. I'm doing very well. I weigh 156. I'm proud of myself, you guys. I am so proud of myself. I know, dear, I'm taking a shot and then pills, but I'm working out and I'm eating right. I'm eating right and everything. And I had slacked down on my workouts, but I was depressed and stuff. But I'm not letting that get to me. I'm back on track and I'm back at it. And I'm not going to stop until I get to my goal. And, and I'm going to try to slow down then on everything once I get to that goal. Because I don't want to get too, too little and stuff then my clothes gonna be falling off of me and I don't want that no more because I know back then when I was in my 30s and stuff I was 90 some pounds I didn't even get close to I, I might have got close to a hundred I used to have to pin safety pins and stuff in my clothes I used to have to shop in the little girl section my mom and I used to have to laugh at me because I used to wear a zero I used to wear a zero that's how little that's how skinny I was but I don't want to get too, too skinny. Because mm -mm. I know I have to get down to my height weight. Because my height is 4'8". I'm 4'8". And I got to get down to that weight for that height and stuff. But, yeah, I had took a picture for Memorial Day. And my sister was just like, oh, you go, girl. You, you, you looking good. I am so proud of you. I told him, I told him thank you. I told him I'm I'm doing it, and my sister she's losing weight and stuff too. So my cousin's supposed to be on the pills and stuff too. So I gotta call her and see if she on the pills. And my son last night made my day. He asked me. They got one extra ticket left for Kayla's graduation. Her graduation is Friday, and I'm bringing you guys along with me and to her graduation. And I told him, heck yeah, you ain't got to ask me that, baby. I, that's my baby there. Don't don't play. Yes, I'm going to her graduation. 
and I looked in my closet, I found me one of my cute little sundresses and my little wedges that I'm going to wear and everything. And I'm going to take pictures and stuff. I'm just so proud of my grandbaby. I don't know what I'm going to get her for her graduation, but it's going to be something. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to the, I'm gonna go to the store and find her something. Because you know me. And she, and she wants a vanity set just like mine. So I'm not going to get her no little girl vanity set. I'm going to get her a, a big girl vanity set for Christmas. But it's not going to be at my house because you know, my house is going to be smaller and stuff. Because I'm going into an apartment. So... But it's real spacious over there, you guys. It's spacious because my nephew told me how spacious it is because he lives over there. And and so I'm buying her a vanity. I found her one on Amazon just like mine. And I think it was 80, 80 some dollars. And that's what I'm getting her for Christmas. I put it in my wish list. And I'm getting her that for Christmas. And she taking it to her house and put it in her bedroom. And my son told me, Mom, her bedroom already full with doll houses, them big old tall doll houses. Well, then that vanity gonna have to squeeze in there too. <laughs> her vanity gonna have to squeeze in there too. Because that's what she want and that's what I'm gonna give her. So she can sit up at her vanity and and play. I'm gonna get her a little mirror to put on her vanity. Well, the mirror can already come with it and everything. But I'm gonna get her extra mirror to put on there and all that. And she can put her little jewelry and stuff in there and on on her vanity and everything because she'll be six years old this year but i'm finna go i just got to pay my bills and stuff and right now i'm gonna go take my son to the grocery store so he can go so i can get some we can get some grocery for the house and i'm gonna come back home get out these clothes put some pjs on and relax and take my medicine for the day I'm going to take my other medicine because right now I'm out of alley pills and I got to go get me some more today. So I hope y'all guys enjoyed this video. And oh yeah, before y'all watch this video, I'm going to put out about jazz. <laughs> I did a reaction on jazz. So y'all going to see that video first before y'all see this one. So don't forget to comment, subscribe, and share my videos. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.